Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to Mr. D's Tech News and Reviews. Today we're going to be taking a quick look at the Manfrotto Compact Advanced Tripod, which is the gray one. I made a video on the black one, so make sure to check that out. So anyways, the Compact Advanced is a medium weight tripod coming in at 50 ounces with a thicker aluminum body than the Compact Action. So this helps you carry twice the weight, having a safety payload of over 6.5 pounds. As far as the height, this one is also a bit taller. You can get the maximum height of almost 65 inches when fully extended. For the extra weight capability and height, you can get the Compact Advance for $100. As you can see, the legs on the tripod have ribbed rubber feet, ensuring that it won't lose its grip on most surfaces. The legs are extended by opening the individual latches and just pulling on the legs. To connect the head on the tripod, you need to press down on the push button while inserting it to the tripod. To lock the head in position, just tighten the side knob. The bottom handle on the head allows you to point the camera up, down, left, and right, and then just twist the handle to the left to lock it in position. The handle on the top allows you to tilt the camera to make sure your shot is level. You can even tilt it far enough to take portrait shots. Once you find your ideal position, just twist the handle. Also, once you're done with the tripod, you can loosen the top handle and swing it to the other side for easier portability. On the bottom of the quick release plate, it's clearly indicated which way the camera lens should be facing once the plate is on the camera. Placing the quick release plate on the tripod is as simple as inserting the front first, opening the lock to allow the rear to enter, and then relocking it. And finally, it comes with a padded bag for easy mobility. Well guys, that was a quick look at the Manfrotto Compact Advanced Tripod. I hope you enjoyed it. Please like and subscribe for more tech reviews. See you next time.